When Danielle Koenig turned 12, which meant playing with full-size soccer balls, the injury started. I hurt my knee. I got tendonitis twice. It's a huge problem. As estimated, girls who play competitive youth soccer suffer at least six times more knee injuries than boys. Oh my God, the amount of injuries right here in this age is just, I mean, unbelievably crazy. Crazy, Danish coach Maigen Gilmartin thought, and possibly preventable. Gilmartin teamed up with some researchers to analyze how girls kick and developed a ball that is smaller, lighter, softer, and possibly safer than the standard full-size ball used by everyone in leagues around the world. When we're hitting the ball that is too big, we have to lift our leg a little too high to actually hit it the correct way. And lifting that actually means that we put a lot of pressure on our knees. This Canadian soccer official heard about the new ball and was immediately interested because he happens to be Danielle Koenig's grandfather. It is possible that some female players might think that this is sexist. However, from the evidence so far, especially in Europe, they find it's exactly the reverse. They're enjoying the game more. At Jacques Koenig's urging, 24 girls teams in Toronto will start testing the new ball, playing games this summer. If it works, there will be fewer knee injuries, perhaps fewer concussions too. But a safer soccer ball can't be a game changer. To pass the test, it has to play like a regular ball. And change can be slow in soccer, which is internationally regulated. But the Toronto experiment is attracting interest across the country. I would park myself as curious. You know, I think injury uh, is always going to be a part of sport. Uh, but if there is a way to reduce injury and not impact the actual method in which the sport is played, that's always a positive. The athletes, the girls' teams, will get a say in the experiment, along with coaches, parents and referees, although one vote is already in. I think it's a good idea. I think it can help. It might even help keep girls in the game. Many get fed up with injuries and quit. The smaller ball could achieve many goals. Haverd Gould, CBC News, Toronto.